Stuck NASA astronauts welcome SpaceX capsule at ISIS. Sunita Williams' new ride home arrives at space station. Williams stranded at ISS since June 2024. What caused the crisis in space? Eight-day mission turns into nightmare. Williams, Wilmore to return to Earth in late February 2025. Sunita Williams and Barry Wilmore stuck at the International Space Station since June 2024 welcomed the SpaceX capsule on September 29th, which will be their new ride back to Earth. SpaceX launched the rescue mission on September 28th with a downsized crew of two astronauts and two empty seats reserved for Butch Wilmore and Sunita Williams, who will return next year in 2025. Remember, Williams and Wilmore's prolonged mission began when a small helium leak was detected in the Boeing Starliner spacecraft. The problem had initially reportedly seemed manageable. However, the situation worsened as more leaks were discovered, coupled with the failure of five crucial thrusters. Despite efforts to manage these issues, the situation has left Williams and Wilmore stranded in space far longer than anticipated. NASA switched Wilmore and Williams to SpaceX following concerns over the safety of their Boeing Starliner capsule. It was the first Starliner test flight with the crew, and NASA decided the thruster failures and helium leaks that cropped up after liftoff were too serious and poorly understood to risk the test pilot's return. So Starliner returned to Earth empty earlier this month. The Dragon carrying NASA's Nick Haig and the Russian space agency's Alexander Gorbanov will remain at the space station until February 2025 turning what should have been a week-long trip for Wilmore and Williams into a mission lasting more than eight months. Two NASA astronauts were pulled from the mission to make room for Wilmore and Williams on the return leg. NASA reportedly likes to replace its station crews every six months or so. SpaceX has provided the taxi service since the company's first astronaut flight in 2020. NASA also hired Boeing for ferry flights after the space shuttles were retired. But flawed software and other Starliner issues led to years of delays and more than $1 billion in repairs. The arrival of Haig and Gorbanov means that four astronauts who have been on the ISS since March 2024 can now prepare to return to Earth in their own SpaceX capsule within the next week. This will bring the station's crew size back to its normal seven members after being temporarily increased due to the delays caused by the Starliner's issues. Wilmore and Williams, both retired Navy captains and seasoned NASA astronauts, have adapted to their extended mission actively participating in routine maintenance and scientific experiments on the ISS.